So we are now on to the next of the quads, this time the junior boys in the Fawley Challenge Cup, Hereford Cathedral School versus George Watson's College. It's George Watson's on the left-hand side, um, but now the right-hand side of your picture with Hereford Cathedral on the left, and a great tight race here, Neil. A great tight race, and uh, this is what we want to see, um, particularly early in the week when some races can be uh, decided a little earlier than this point. Um, so great to see both crews look quite relaxed, composed within themselves um, and on the Buckinghamshire station now Hereford Cathedral School did look there as if they were starting to move ahead three-quarter mile signal tells us that actually what's happened is that George Watson's have come back and they've taken a very slight lead yeah I think this is going to be a good tussle the whole way if they're at this point in the race and still this close it's anyone's game there's Hereford Cathedral School on the right hand side of your picture just on the borders of Wales uh, sort of West Midlands way and on the left hand side of your picture there George Watson's they actually wrote on the canal up in Edinburgh it's a really tiny canal where you can barely get a, a quad down it so extremely great to see them here at Henley contesting in these big boats uh, absolutely they've done very well to do that um, it's a lovely story actually about the Hereford Cathedral School um, crew. The, the two man, William Morgan Jones, actually his great granddad rode for Hereford Cathedral School. Uh, he's incredibly proud therefore to be uh, representing the school here today. First time since 2006 that they've, uh, uh, that they've been in the regatta. And, and again, this is bowel to bowel um, as we approach the foot of the, the enclosures shaping up to be a really close race as we come towards the finish. Yeah, this is great to see both of these uh, crews in this Fawley Challenge Cup, neither of which we usually see sort of contesting in the boys' quadruple skulls event. George Watson's only qualified an eight into the PE for the first time just a few years ago. They're now back here in the Fawley. Great to see the back qualifying a different boat, um, but really, really close. We're looking at the backs there of George Watson's now I think that uh, they've just taken the rate up ever so slightly as they feel that it's within their fingertips here, Neil. Yes, they're at 36 now. In fact, I think they've made a move. Meanwhile, Hereford Cathedral School, 35. So they're really both crews now starting to raise their rates as they come towards the final sprint for the line. And in that shot where we had both crews, you can see that it's still incredibly tight between the two crews. Yeah, I could see that Seidel in the bow seat for Hereford Cathedral School just took a quick glance to his right. You could see the overlap that they've got on George Watson's college. And my word, this is close. Hereford Cathedral School are now charging for the line. I think it was Watson's about two strokes ago. But here come Hereford Cathedral School. What an acceleration of speed. Watson's now trying to push back. Who's got it left in the tank here? Yep, Hereford Cathedral School raising the rate again as they come to the line but it's not quite enough. I think we'll have to leave it to the judges, but it looked to me um, as though George Watson's college got that by a few feet. Yeah, we'll wait for the verdict on that one, but a real humdinger down the course, what we love to see here on the Wednesday, just the first day of racing here at Henley Royal Regatta, and that is the quality that we have to look forward to. I think we are looking at the winners here, but that's just by, by our eye here in the commentary box. We'll wait to have that confirmed. And you can hear the voice of Matthew Pinson there, I think, in the uh, umpire's launch. And here is the replay. Yes, indeed. Look at that. That's the difference between progressing through this regatta or not. Less than a canvas in it to George Watson's college. They will be absolutely delighted. But Hereford Cathedral School must be so proud. They gave them such a great race down the course. Yes, um, that was a great race. Um, and it wasn't, it was in doubt, frankly. It was in doubt, frankly, right until the end.